let's ask one of our front end engineers how he does the same thing. Now, he's hard at work, so I'm gonna have to find some way to get his attention and remind him that he agreed to talk with us. I think the dark gun should do the trick. Hi, I'm Jacques. I'm the lead front end engineer here at Udacity. And I've been with the company now for about two and a half years. Uh, and I was just gonna run you through sort of how I approach a new design. So uh, when I get something like this, everything on the web is boxes. So I start out uh, sort of understanding and cutting up the boxes that I'm going to use. And that starts with the big box that is your whole page. And from there, I sort of split it up piece by piece and we work from big to small. So in the first cut, it's gonna be, there's a big box at the top here for your head content, your logo, your text, that kind of stuff. You have a big box here with your image in it, and you have a big box here with this footer, uh, all these footer elements. And as you can see, actually inside of the footer, there are three um, sort of small boxes with those image and the text, and one sort of box that goes across the top of it with this featured work. And so I work from the, from the big uh, side into the small side, and when I started out, uh, I did this uh, with a pencil. I, you, know, you start drawing out, here's a big box. This is going to be the header. And you can actually fill in the content later. You don't actually have to worry about it. You can move from the big to the small. So how you're going to position this uh, logo here, how you're going to make this text show up, you can put that off until later. Those are smaller boxes. So start with the big boxes and work down from there. So just sketch it out. And as you do this more often, you'll be able to do it, start doing it in your head. Um, but if you get, if you're having any trouble, especially starting out, just go for a pencil. It's a, it's a great tool. 